Hi boys and girls, let's get ready for today's lesson. You already know that the letter J captures the sound J. Today you're going to learn a spelling rule for the sound J. I want you to listen to these three words. Ledge, badge, bridge. What sound do you hear at the end of those three words? I hear J at the end of those three words. And you know that J captures the sound J. Let's take a look at the word ledge. We stacked the pile of books on the ledge in the library. Ledge. What three letters are making the J sound at the end of ledge? D, G, E are the three letters that are making the sound J at the end of the word ledge. L, E, J. What do you see right before the D, G, E? There is a vowel right before the D, G, E. This vowel is making the short sound because it is a closed syllable. So we mark that E with our brev. Remember, closed syllable words are when we have one vowel closed in by one consonant and they make their short sound. DGE is the way we would spell the J sound. When that J sound comes at the end of a word, after a short vowel. Let's take a look at the next word. Badge. The police officer wears a badge on his uniform. Badge. What three letters do you see at the end of the word badge? I see DGE at the end of the word badge. What is DGE saying at the end of the word badge? DGE is making the sound J. I see a vowel right before the DGE. What vowel sound is the A making in badge? If you are unsure, check your seven. Did you say the A is making the short sound? You are correct. The A captures the sound A ah in badge because it is a closed syllable word. When we have the sound J at the end of a word after a short vowel, we spell that J with a D G E. But remember, that vowel needs to be short. Let's take a look at a third word, bridge. We drove over the bridge to get to the city. Bridge. So you tell me, what do you see capturing the J sound at the end of the word bridge? Did you say DGE is capturing the sound J? Why did we spell the J sound in bridge with a DGE? It is spelled with a DGE because it comes after a short vowel and is at the end of a word. To help you remember the spelling rule for DGE, here I have a picture of a bridge for you. It's helping us remember that the J sound at the end of a word after a short vowel is spelled with DGE. Let's review what we learned today and lock it in. How do we spell J at the end of a word when it follows a short vowel? We would spell it with D, G, E. What sound does D, G, E capture? It captures the sound J. The dash tells us that the D, G, E comes at the end of the word or syllable. So let's trace and say J. J. 
J. Let's review the spelling rule. When do we use D, G, E to capture the sound J? We use it when the J sound is at the end of a word after a short vowel. What kind of vowel has to be before the DGE? A short vowel has to come before DGE. Where in a word will we see DGE? DGE comes at the end of a word or syllable. Today you're going to be reading words and text with DGE at the end. If you have any questions, please send me a message in Google Classroom.